so today we're gonna make a Tana beat in the style of his new song Noya and kind of his like vibe he's going for recently with dreamy ambient beats. So I started by going into D.Va and taking the Taz Butterfly preset. This is like kind of a chord preset and this is what I put down. So a very basic progression. On that I have a portal preset. And I have C6 just uh, to reduce some of the eye. C6 is basically just a multiband compressor. Then I went into Spire and I put down this simple lead. This instrument kind of sits in the background of the beat. That's why I put reverb on it with the mix at 47%. Next I went into Contact in the Ignition Keys bank, which is a very good bank for those dreamy ambient beats. Uh, this is what I put down, this is a lead. So I basically just put down this melody on the first two bars and then I copied it over and just switched some of the notes and deleted the first note just so it adds variation. For the effects on that I have uh, this uh, effect tricks preset which is very simple. Then I went into Serum and I laid down this ARP which basically just goes up the scale four notes and uh, basically the same thing an octave higher. This is the cute plug in the Canopsia bank. This is what it sounds like. For the effects on that, I put this bit crush to get the retro sound and I put this reverb just for the ambience. And finally I got this one shot which is basically just a sub bass and this is what I put down. So that's what the whole melody sounds like together. Next for the drums I got two different 808s, the first one is just a classic CTM and this is what it sounds like. And the second one is one of my favorite 808 which is in the Flying Nimbus kit by Cody, this is what it sounds like. Then I got this clap. I got this snare, this is what it sounds like. And a trick to make those snare rolls is to go in the one third step. And this makes very good snare rolls. And here I alternated between the one third step and one fourth step. Then I got those hi-hats. Then I got this perk. Finally this open hat. This is what the drums sound like all together. Some of y'all wanted to know how I mix my beat. Basically I just level my stuff. I don't go too hard on EQs and compressors. And on my master I have a soft clipper which is basically on default preset. And I have a, a limiter uh, with the attack, the release and the sustain all turned down. Make sure to follow me if the tutorial helped you. And yeah, I'll see you in the next tutorial. This is the final beat. <laughs>